Welcome back, everybody, to 70 Sedan Alpha 21. This is the Dead is Dead series, and we are going to start Life 3. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> I can't believe we've died so so quickly, uh, so soon. I just wasn't expecting that to happen. But we've had some, you know, kind of bad luck, and, you know, I probably haven't made the smartest decisions in the world either, but that's just the, the way it goes. Uh, so, as you can see, we are starting Life 3 here. We've got the, the usual settings on all of these tabs, and we're going to jump right in and get started with the new game here. Okay, so we are finished with our, the opening quest. And we are 2.2 clicks away from the trader. So we're not, we're actually in a different um, area on the map than, than the other places we've started. So we have to go to the east from here. Um, dang, I hope that doesn't go into the burn pile. But uh, this is the same POI that we had our base in in Life 2, except for it's in a different location on the map, though. So since we're here, let's go in here and what is this? Uh, chance to harvest acid. Okay, that's a good one. Um, hopefully we can luck out and find the cooking pot in here. Yeah, it is. It's in here. Awesome. Okay. So yeah, we might as well loot this place whilst we're here. And that's a nice little pile of stuff. Chicken ration. Yeah, let's eat it right now. We'll take all of these chairs and scrap them. We'll check in the kitchen and we'll probably have to kill all the Zeeks that are in the house here, which we can do. Get ourselves a little bit of XP. There's some miso. That's good. We'll save that for later. A couple of potatoes. We need some bones uh, to make our nut, our first knife. I'm not going to take that. Okay, let's grab that cookie pot. That's great that we found that already. Yeah, oh, shit. There's a zombie doodle right there. Dang. Um. All right, here. I want to make my 20 building blocks that I typically make and we need to do our points also so just like before we're going to do uh, from the shadows we're going to do deep cuts we're going to go to fortitude and do cardio and we're going to go to strength and do pummel peat okay so we got those guys done let's scrap you we'll get rid of you I think we're going to chuck the copy for the moment, let's take uh, the arrows and craft four more of those to get rid of that slot. Okay, and I'm just going to block this so the lumberjack doesn't think he can come out this way. And why don't we actually use this because um, they're really easy and cheap to make, and they're way stronger than wood. Yes, yeah, so it only takes five stone to make that, so we'll just make a new one. Okay. Wait, where's he at? Oh, he's right there. Okay. So that should be good enough for us to get a sneaky sneak. There we go. Okay. So we'll just have to use the club on him. I suppose we could try and light him up. Uh, because we don't have enough bones for our first kniff yet. But he, he's not going to like, break that. Not in a million years. Well, I mean, he would in a million years, but <laughs> we'll be done before then. Yeah, so we'll put another burn on him. It's taking forever to kill this guy. There we go. Okay, let's leave that there. And if we have to get out of here in a hurry, we'll go that same direction again. Um, That's not worth enough money for us to justify hanging on to it for now. Okay, there's usually a Zombo in this room too. Yeah, there's an Arlene. Let's close that. Put that there. Uh, 
now. We can't put that down there. Can we, um... I don't know if she can get through that or not. Here, let's get this out of the way. Okay, I'm just going to upgrade this. No, she can't get through. Okay, good. Oh, are you stuck in the floor? She's stuck in the floor. All right, well, that works in our favor. She did. Okay. Hmm. Is there a zombie in the bathroom? The last couple times I've been in this house, there hasn't been one, but that doesn't... There also wasn't a lumberjack down below either, so... Um... Okay, let's grab this. Let's see if we can get some clothing here. Okay, that's a little bit better than what we're wearing. Not not a ton, but a little bit. That's better. Okay. Do we have a Zombo in here? I don't think so. I think... The Whatever we were hearing was upstairs. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Nice. We get a little bit more water. Okay. Let's go up here. Uh, I don't see anybody up in the attic. Nobody out there. There's usually a zombie in this room. Hmm. Okay. Let's um let's poke our head in here. Okay, we're safe in here for the moment. Let's grab the desk. Okay, we'll definitely take that poncho. Ammunition. Nice. Switch to those for the moment. And there's a bag up here for us to loot. With a seed thingy and a scope, which we're probably just going to sell for now because it's not doing us a damn bit of good. I don't think there's anything out here. Well, there's a bird's nest. Check this. Nope. Don't care about that. We'll pick this up and scrap it. Uh, scrap this. Okay, I'm going to take the miso, but we'll save the chili. Okay. Oh, shit! I was expecting her to be in the other room. She must have been up on the roof or something. Come on, Darlene. There you go. Get out of here. Okay, let's go back up here and... Check in here. Yeah, this is. I thought she was in here. Potato seed. Eh, okay, well, I guess we'll grab it for the moment because we can sell it. And we are finished with this house. Let's bomb a nose. We can just leave that there. Okay, so we have to. Uh, we got to go that way. Jeez, I hope that doesn't lead us into the freaking. Um, whatchamacallit? Uh, burned bile? We, the chances of us being able to survive in the burn bomb at this point are extremely thin. <laughs> I mean, extremely thin. The Probably the worst thing in the burn bomb, well, aside from dogs, and those are, you know, bad enough, 
is the burn zombies are one of the fastest zombies in the game. They just flat out book it. Uh, on insane. So, oh good, we got a honey. Nice. So, we don't want to... We don't want to have to mess with that if we don't have to. Why don't we poke our head in this house here? Um... There's, I think there's going to be one zombie in here, and I think there's usually a snake in here, too. That is worth some coin, so we'll take that. Uh, is there anything in this little shed? No, we got a workbench and a trash. We'll take that. Okay, more brass. That's good. You know what? We don't need this potato seed. I know we can sell it for four coin, but... We're not going to take it right now. Let's check this trash here. I need one more bone, and then I can make our knife. Are there any gut piles around? Um, let's go check over here first before we get into that house. We'll take both of those. We'll take... There we go. That's what we needed. Let's repair that, and we don't need the, those bones now. Come well, on, give us something really good. That's good. Not going to complain about water. Who the hell put sand in garbage? What the, what's up with that? else going on over here possible clothes no uh, shoes I think what we're wearing is better oh wait no I guess no these are better yeah it's gonna say these sell for 12 though so that's a decent amount of coin for where we're currently at uh, we can pick some potatoes here. That gives us five potatoes. All right, let's go up here. And there's usually a Zeke right down in here. I'm not going to get a headshot, but we can shoot him in the nuts at least. He wants to stay there, we'll just keep shooting at him. It's fine with me. Nope, oh, we gotta switch now to stone arrows. Can we get to him from back here now? With our knife, get a bleed on him. Where the hell's he going? Now he wants to break through here. Got him. Beautiful. Okay. So, like I said, I think there's also a snake in here. Yeah, he's right there. Let's try that again. Got him. Okay, that should clear the place. Give me my arrow. Okay, weapons bag. Let's see what's in here. Rifles and some bow parts. Okay, take that. Pretty soon we'll be able to make corn meat, uh, cornbread, so I want to kind of hang on to the cornbread. How about a grill? No, I don't want that shit. Okay, there's some clothes here. I'll take that. Water, maybe? Nope, just paper. Don't care about that. Okay, that, I believe, is it. Oh, yeah, let's get these arrows back. Nice. Nope, that was the coal. Okay. Let's, uh, let's keep on keeping on. We 
got a long ways to go. That Sambo that walked by over there is a the skater punk guy, and he's pretty tough, but don't don't want to mess with him. Yeah, get the hell out of here. Okay, let's go this way. Got another house we can poke our head into. Making sure we're as clear as possible from Zika Ruskies. Uh, do 10 more damage to coal and burnt wood. Okay. I'll do that. I'll take those. And I'll those. All right. We got a couple Zeeks in the yard over there. But let's just poke our head in here real quick. Okay, can we poke our head around the corner here and try these luggage things for some more clothing? All right, we'll take that. Uh, okay, so I always get this mixed up. Is it the green numbers, the one... Compared to what we're wearing, I think it is. Yeah, so this one here is better. Okay, so let's crap that one. All right, we shall continue on here. We've got a nice flat area here where, where we can see a long ways away. Okay, so we have a Darlene and a Yo. Got Yo's attention. Okay, let's go this way. Um, we don't need those bones. They're not doing us any good right now. Okay, going over this mountain area is going to be a little sketch. An egger. I wonder if we can go kind of go around it, except for the burnt biomes over that way. Nice. Okay, so that means we can eat our sham sandwiches as food and we well we only have one so still i think that gives what 15 right yep we lose a little bit of health though but that's okay okay we got somebody over this way it is uh tom clark let's go over this way See if we can get him to go that way. At some point, we're still going to have to go through these mountains, I think. And that that's going to be... That's going to be tricky. <clears throat> but this is the direction we got to go in, so... Let's just see what we can do. It's interesting to see... Navis gain expanded like this because it's normally only a 6k map. Okay, we got a Darlene there. 
and a chicken. Let's go around her if we can. There's a, a yo, I think, on the hill right in front of us. Yeah, that's a yo. Okay, let's grab this chicken. Let's get Darlene out of here. Okay, we're encumbered by two points. Get rid of the bones. How much is this worth? Yeah, you know what? That's not helping us right now. Let's just get rid of it as well. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can kind of work our way up this little draw area here. Can we just go right up through here? This would be a bad time to run into a Zeke. Not that there's ever really a good time to run into a Zeke. Pretty rugged terrain right through here. Um, okay, can we kind of just do this without breaking our leg? Shit. We got a bow. Get out of here, Bo. Man, she really thumped us good. She's got to be getting close, though. Okay. Nope, not going to take any of that. Let's check this for honey. I'm also going to move. Oh, I thought we had some bandages, but I guess we don't. We should make some. Just to stop ble bleeding, you know, if it happens, of course. We do have one honey, so that's good. Yeah, this was a rough start for us, man. Being this far away from the trader and having to go through this rugged terrain. But we have a passage through here, so at least we don't have to go over another mountain yet. Edgar, you weren't supposed to see me. And we're also supposed to take that arrow, too. Give you a couple more bleeds and try and keep from getting hit. Nice. Refresh your bleeds. And he dropped a bag for us. Nice. They'll make us thirsty, but they will also heal us up. So that was a good find. Okay. We're going to have to have a come to Jesus meeting with some of our stuff here. Um, I don't want to turn this into more arrows because that'll use up all of our stones. What's this worth? Yeah, that's worth a lot. We could just eat these potatoes straight up. Let's do that. Three things of plastic. Are not doing us a damn bit of good. Okay, let's go. Um, nope, not gonna take that. I said I'm not gonna take that. How many eggs do we have? Seven. Okay, so that that's a you know pretty decent food for us as well. Do you want to kind of? Be cognizant of the hillsides because there could be zombies on them. We're getting close. I I think this is gonna be Trader Bob. 
where we're headed, but I'm not 100% sure. And Trader Bob actually would not be a bad trader to live near. That would be A-OK -okay with me. There's a Darlene right where we need to go. Now, looks like we might be uh, coming up to a town as well. The first town we've seen in this series. We haven't survived long enough so far to get there. And, you know, this map, of course, if you guys didn't see the very first episode, when we talked about the map, um, it's got some pretty good-sized towns and even cities on it. Which is very cool. Okay, we'll go around this way. Let's check this stump here. Okay, so this is cool. Got ourselves a town. And I actually have no idea who this trader is going to be. I want to say Trader Bob was on the east end of the original map. And maybe he was. I don't remember. It's been such a long time. But because this is a whole town, which normally wouldn't be here, um, who knows what trader it is. We'll, we'll find out, though. Could this possibly be, like, the new and improved Dyersville? We are kind of in that area of the map. Maybe that's what this is. Soldier guy over there. I can barely see him. Okay. Got a nurse Nancy over here and some other Zeeks. Come on, Nancy. Chase the stone. You know you want to. There she goes. Ronnie McDonnie. We may end up having to fight him. He's kind of right where we need to go. Let's see if we can get him to go over this way. Okay, we've got Tom Clark over there. Nurse Nancy this way. Uh, what trader is this? Is it wrecked? No, I think it is, Bob. All right. <clears throat> yeah, this is Bob. Good. Bob Salvage. The other good thing about uh, finding Bob is he's got, I think he has the most stuff to loot out of all the traders. So let's do this. Let's go in here. Your money is welcome here. I want to sell him, um, what I currently have so we can make room to go get more stuff to sell him. Okay, hang on to that. I think we want to keep all the rest of his stuff. Gratitude and safe travels. Okay, friend. so we have we should have enough time to to loot him, so let's do it. Man, it is like seriously stuttery here. We'll grab all the gas that he has, because maybe we'll get enough to be able to sell him. Sell him, sell it to him. I'm gonna ignore those zombos.
Yeah, this is this is not well optimized. Really got some bad uh, frame rate going on here. Some pipes. I don't remember Trader Bob being like this in the normal game, so it's something with the mod. Nice. Couple repair kits. We'll take those. Uh, I guess we can't loot that shelf. Can we loot this one? Yeah. More plastics. We do want plastic for the dew collector. Okay. And this is freaking wigging me out. Okay, I think I got everything. Hello, traveler. Hello. Do you have anything to loot in here? Water? Yeah, nice. Okay. Alright, Bob. Let's do some more sales to you. I'm gonna sell you all of this. That we will repair before we sell it to him. I'm gonna keep that stuff. He's not going to want that. He's not going to want these, but let's actually... Y'all come back now. Repair this before we chop both of those bones. All right, we'll sell all of the brass. I'm going to keep the paper, the feathers. We'll sell as much gas as he'll buy, all of that. No, Safe wait travels. A I want that... Uh... Shit. I want that... Did I get the iron back to repair these? Um, there we go. Okay. Okay, drop, 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 drop. And we still didn't have enough to repair those, so let's do this. Let's go... Let's grab those. Perfect. Okay. So we get 96 coin for those. That's definitely a lot of a lot of coin for us at this point. So we wanted to maximize that. You can have these. You can have those. You can have the paper. Doesn't want them. We're keeping the plastic. We'll sell them the springs. We're keeping that. And I think that's everything. Gratitude and safe travels, friend. We scrap those nails. Can we then? Sell him a little bit more iron? Yes, we can. Okay. So that uh, brings us up to 659 coin, uh, which is a nice little chunk of change, but I think we're going to use that pretty much entirely on water. Thank you, Survivor. And Chick same Bass thing here. Let's buy daily. all the water he's got. Well, that leaves us with 299. Does he have any medical bandages? 
Um, if he did, it would be under science, right? Nope. Just taking a quick, quick look, see at what he's got. Can't afford really any of that stuff. Nice pipe machine gun. Okay. Oh, my apologies. Check back again, and I may have what you're looking for. Okay, so we have five clean waters and six dirty waters. We have ten eggs. We still have some chili. In fact, you know what? Let's eat the chili right now. And meat to make grilled meat when the time comes. In fact, we have another point, too, don't we? Aha, uh -huh, yes, we do. Uh, let's put that... Well, shoot. Should we put that... You know what? I think we should actually do is put this... Put that into archery. And then we'll, we'll probably do the next point in Master Chef. Just because I think that's us, what's going to be the most immediately useful to us. All right, very good. Um, so, next order of business here is we've got to figure out where we're going to live. Uh, we're going to obviously live in town here and near the trader. Maybe that house over there could be our, our place. What do we got going on out here? Hmm. Okay, here. Let's close that door. What about this building? Might be a little too close to the trader. Can we put anything down here? Yeah, we could. Because we can start put oh, shit, scare me. We can start putting stuff down right here, and that's gonna be a wall anyways. I don't know how feasible this place would be though. Here, let's get away from him for a second so I can do this. Somebody else's attention. Yeah, I I don't know what the hell's inside of there. It probably goes down underground, so let's just do this house here. At least for tonight. And more specifically, we're gonna we're gonna perch up purchase perch perch. Jeez Louise, what's the matter with my mouth? Don't answer that question. Uh, up on the the roof. Oops. Are we actually safe up here? Though is the question. Okay, so it looks like that was a collapsing floor that they, the Zeeks that were up in the attic fell through. So I think we're okay. Um, if they can actually get into this tower and start beating on that, we'll have to try and counter them. But I think we can, I think we can survive the night on this roof. Well, you know what else? If we really wanted to play it safe, we could even go up here all right just have to leave that there all right guys well i think we're going to wrap up the episode here i'm just going to hunker down for the night and in the morning we will have to figure out where our actual base is going to be and it could be this house uh, or we could you know possibly look at a, a couple other places right around uh, Trader Bob here. And, oh, uh, you know what? I forgot to get a job from him, but that's okay. We, we'll do that uh, tomorrow morning, too, after we, you know, figure out where our actual base is going to be. So, we survived day one. My goodness. <laughs> but that's what we've done. It's always day two so far that we've died. So, the question now will be, can we survive day two? And that we'll only, we'll only know that when day two comes. 
So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Thank you.